Hello and welcome back to another episode of Caps on Comics. I'm Kenny Caps and today I'm going to be giving you a tour of my updated comic book collection. Let's get started. Alright, so we're going to start here at the very top. We're going to go through Golden Age all the way down to the Modern Age. So, most of these comic books are first appearances, but some aren't. Alright, this is Pep Comics number one, first appearance of The Shield. And it's the, noteworthy for being the first ever patriotic superhero. He predates Captain America by a few months. This is Blue Bolt number one. This is the first published work of Jack Kirby and Joe Simons. First time they ever did anything together. Now we're going to go through a series of World War II comic books. There's Flash, Superman. Sorry for the glare. All right, this is Captain Marvel. This is noteworthy for being a uh, Rockford pedigree. It's very low grade. Some poor guy, his butt basement flooded, and you can see the rippling on it. And I sent it back to CGC, and they dropped it down from a 9.8 to a 4. All right, so World War II Green Lantern, Green Arrow and Speedy. All right, Liz Comics, Captain America. All right, this is a great cover of him just battling some Nazis. Wonder Woman, another Captain Marvel World War II. All right, this is The Guardian, another Jack Kirby, Joe Simon, after they had been fired from um, National, whatever, Precursor, Timely, thank you, Timely Comics. And they're working for DC at this point. Superman, Blue Beetle, America's Best Comics, featuring some other characters. Super Patriotic, Green Hornet, Superman, Batman. And now we're officially out of World War II. This is post-war. This is the first appearance of the Fighting American. This is after Jack Kirby and Joe Simon had been fired from Timely. They made their second character, another patriotic character, called the Fighting American. It's the first appearance of him. Captain America number 76. All right, this is the commie smasher, right? So this is noteworthy. This is the point where Timely has changed to Atlas Comics. This is the first Atlas comic. First appearance of Martian Manhunter. First Silver Age Flash. First appearances of the Challengers of the Unknown, a precursor to the Fantastic Four. All right, move on down here. Supergirl tryout, first appearance of Supergirl. First Silver Age appearance of Aquaman and his origin. We have the Double Life of Private Strong. This is a, a re or just like a sec Silver Age appearance of the Shield. This is also done by Jack Kirby and Joe Simon. It's also the first appearance of the Fly. First Silver Age Green Lantern. First Justice League. First appearance of Groot. First Silver Age Hawkman. First Silver Age Adam. First appearance of the Fantastic Four. First Hank Pym. First Hulk. First Spider Man. First Thor. First Iron Man. First Sergeant Fury. First Wasp. And this is a fake, it just covers my light switch. On this aisle. First Doctor Strange, first Avengers. First appearance of the Justice Society in the Silver Age. First X-Men. This is an interesting one. This is Captain America's first appearance in, since like uh, 54, this is 63. So it was a tryout to see if, popular, if Captain America would be popular enough to bring back. So after, you know, nine years, they decided to bring him back. And they retconned it as this is just the acrobat. First Quicksilver and Scarlet Witch. First Silver Age Captain America. First Daredevil. First Black Widow. First Teen Titans. First Hawkman. Hawkeye, my bad. First time uh, Captain America was with the Howling Commandos. First appearance of Nick Fury. First Silver Surfer. First Silver Age appearance of Plastic Man. First Black Panther. First Silver Age appearance of Blue Beetle. Drawn by the Steve Ditko after he quit Marvel. First Batgirl. And down we go. Alright. First Adam Warlock. First Carol Danvers. First Guy Gardner. 
first red tornado, the origin of shield and an iconic cover by Starenko. First vision, first guardians of the galaxy, first Falcon, first dark side, first new gods, first Mr. Miracle, first Morbius, it's Morbin time. First John Stewart, first Luke Cage, first Ghost Rider, first Drax the Destroyer and Thanos, First appearance of Shazam, or Captain Marvel as I like to call him, since the Golden Age. First Blade. And final row. First Punisher. First Iron Fist. Hulk cameo on the back. I mean, Wolverine cameo. First full Wolverine appearance and cover. Second Wolverine appearance and first lineup of the new X-Men. First appearance of Nightcrawler, Storm, Colossus, yada, yada, yada. First Gamora. First Moon Knight. First Eternals, first Nova, first Miss Marvel, first Spider Girl, first Black Lightning, first Firestorm, first She Hulk, first Star Lord in a comic book format, first appearance of Raven, Starfire, and Cyborg, first Rocket Raccoon, and first full appearance of War Machine. Now, the ones that didn't make the cut first Harley Quinn, first Conan. First Red Sonia, first Dracula in a comic book, first appearance of Rom, first Star Wars, or Star Wars number one, first appearance of the Viet Forever People, first full appearance of Dark Side, first Scott Lang, who will become Ant Man, first Jessica Drew, first Winter Soldier, first Gwen, Spider Gwen, and first Miles Morales. Also, some things of interest. This is a Mary Marshall, Mary Marvel Marching Society membership piece. A no prize from Marvel. Autograph Stan, Stanley Lithograph. And there's his autograph down there. Danny O'Neill's typewriter. A certificate of authenticity. And the last final thing. Jack Kirby's autograph. Right there.